We can use this button in the software. Open our project address. The URL is this. The software provides detailed explanation of the function of pressing each button. Let's start to demonstrate some of the functions. Cart type refers to the pair of cards. Cart type scanning. During the scanning process, the red light of the device will flash. Please do not perform other operations until the red light stops flashing. This button is called automatic cracking. This function is used to write cards. No need to distinguish cards, this button is for restoring data. You only need this button to write. This button formats the card. If you use UFUID or PFUID, you can click LockUID after writing the data. This button is to modify the card number. Enter a card number. Then click this button to modify it. It supports modifying the card number of UAT and CUAT. And in the process, BCC offset printing will be automatically repaired. In the process of cracking, if you want to use a password you already know, you can click use key here and enter keys. Via the enter key, you can enter multiple sets of passwords. Then click start execution, and they are going to use these codes to try to solve it. Required reading means Manually enter part of the password in the password area. Note that this password is a password you already know, rather than writing nonsense. Then click this button. We'll read this card with the password required in the password area. If some passwords in the password area are wrong, the corresponding sector will not be read. Dick scan refers to the four points corresponding to the scan. The software has several special functions. For example, upload key. It means that all the card and lock passwords will be, after aggregating into one file, upload to the device. After you delete the software or replace the computer, you can choose to download the key. Also download the previously uploaded file. If you want to use download password, you can click dig scan to use the password. Use key point dig file. It's a summary of all the card passwords that have been cracked. This is a one-click encryption function. After one-click encryption, you can enter the specified password. To fully encrypt the card, if you need a random password, you can tick Use Random Password. After checking, enter the password and click OK. All passwords become fully encrypted. Data becomes fully encrypted. After writing,
The written card is fully encrypted, has a certain anti-cracking ability. Right-click in the data area. You can also choose to read and write separately. The password in the password area will be used when reading and writing. When writing a card, if the original card itself is already encrypted, card with password, you can choose write use key, then write. This way it will use the password of the password field to write the data for this card. If not ticked, then use the default F passwords to write. This is importing data. And save the data. This is a file where you can compare the two data. This feature applies to mainland Chinese, a system for analyzing data. Pay attention to this string of prompts in English. NAC card supports many functions. You can choose whether to write the password configuration bit format card and using passwords to read and write cards and supports writing information Wi-Fi app, etc. Also supports NAC signature reading and writing. It takes a long time to write a signature. Please pay attention to the code prompt and then move the card. Let's read it again after writing. You can see that the signature has been changed. This place can be done on blocks alone. Field and CPU card can be scanned. Please connect the card first, then scan. He scans out common system files. You can also enter the catalog here. The app do directive can be sent here. You can enter multiple lines, for example. The high frequency card can perform quick operations here. The shortcut is preset. Pay attention. On the left is the name of your shortcut command. On the right is the command that Proxmark Max needs to execute. And you can add a delay. You can create a macro. In the option of CMD instruction, you can enter it yourself. You can also load these things. If you need to loop, then check the loop. Low frequency card. This button scans all low frequency card types. If you already know the type of card corresponding to it, you can choose to read and write here.
the yield plus one function will add one to the card number each time. This is sniff analysis. Support card sniffing and card simulation. Ancient card sniffing and simulation cards. After checking neck, fill in the length of the card number. You can simulation neck. This can list the results of sniffing. Here are the results of offline sniffing. Offline sniffing refers to when the device has power. Even if the computer is not connected, press and hold the side button for 10 seconds. Ready to use. There are now offline show results. We can order this and download the offline show exploration results. You can also choose to erase. Is that so? There is no log of offline repair inside the chip. This can analyze the repair process. Mainly used for CPU card and other password show probe analysis. Firmware special brush, boot first then full image. If you tick this button, the firmware of the app will be swapped. App is available at project address.